which expression is equivalent to the square root of 75? I'm gonna show you two ways to do this. The first way will be by hand, and then we will do it with the calculator. All right, let's go ahead and begin. So I went ahead and copied the square root of 75 over here on my paper. And if we're gonna do it by hand, the first thing that we need to do is make a factor tree. So what that means is I need to find two numbers. When I multiply together, I will get 75. And one of the numbers is obviously going to be five because this number ends in five. So let's go ahead and do 75 divided by five to see what number this one will be. So 75 divided by five, and that is 15. So five times 15 is 75. All right, five is a prime number. So what that means is that I cannot divide five by any number other than one and itself. 15 is not prime, okay? There are two numbers that I can multiply to get 15, and that is three and five. And as we said, five is prime. Three is also prime, okay? Because I cannot divide three by any number other than one and itself, which is three. So my numbers here are, my factors are three times five times five. So basically I just put them in order from small, smallest to greatest. All right, so what you're gonna do now is you're gonna take out the pair. So I'm gonna do my square root, okay? I have two fives. Do you see how I have two fives? If you have two of a number, you can go ahead and put it outside. And this is single alone. I'm gonna go ahead and put it inside. So basically this is my answer. This expression is equivalent to this expression. So five and square root of three. So my answer would be A, okay? Five and then a square root of three, that would be my answer. So I'm gonna show you another way that you can do this with the calculator. Okay, so let's go back over here. Now how you can do this with the calculator is let's go ahead and put um, the square root of 75 in the calculator. So I'm gonna go ahead and zoom out over here so you can see my calculator, all right? So I'm gonna go ahead and do the square root of 75. So how you put the square root is control x squared 75, push enter, and my answer is like 8.66025. I'm gonna go ahead and just write 8.66, okay? And what I'm gonna do is each one, one by one, I'm gonna put them in the calculator. So let's go ahead and put five, and then just square root of three, so control x squared three, push enter, and that is 8.66025, it's the same number, so that's how I know that's the answer, right? It's the same number, so A is my answer. Let's put another one just to practice, okay? This one is 15 square root, so control x squared five, 33.541, completely different. Okay, let's let's go ahead and do three square root of five. Control X squared, five. You put them exactly the same way like you see them, okay? And the last one, so that's not the same, right? Six is not the same as eight. Let's go ahead and put five, control X squared, 15, enter, 19.3649. completely different. So as you can see, this is the answer. So this is just a very simple way to do it with the calculator. If you like this video, please give it a like, leave a comment, subscribe. Let me know in the comments section, which way did you prefer? Did you like doing it by hand or did you like doing it by the calculator? Let me know. Thank you so much for watching and see you soon.